this is interesting. Uh, I feel like every year we find out that more animals glow in the dark. Every th- year. That has been like a real a, a, a trend lately. We found a it trend. With, I, wanted to, I want to say it was like a quoll. And then I remember when they found out green sea turtles. We talked about the glowing dog from CRISPR. Yeah. like yeah. Everything, yeah. everything glows in the dark now. But 82% of species of birds of paradise are biofluorescent, a new study found. Well, I mean, if you ask someone who watched the first planet Earth. Jesus. It's, it's strong. It's moldy. Does it taste moldy? No, it tastes delicious. It tastes I've had three glasses. glasses. Um, oh, tastes good to me. We're talking about the booze we're drinking. Pat's being meager about it, but I love you still. <laughs> I got a big bite of mold in mine. <laughs> There's um, no mold. <laughs> Can't maybe, live maybe in, it in my glass. But the <laughs> first planet Earth, I feel like the most memorable <laughs> sequence is the birds of paradise mating. Oh, yes. It's definitely. like the thing that everyone talked about. It was the cover photo of oh. the planet Earth. You know what Can I mean? We, it was like the the like thumbnail was the birds of paradise. This, let's this let's get just a little like 10 second. I think it'll be YouTube friendly if we just get a so, little I mean, glimpse at it. They're incredibly colorful, right? These birds of paradise. Yep. Oh, they're yeah. so cool. There they are. Yeah, beautiful. And that's they glow a, in the dark. That's a 12 wire. I'm not sure what that species is. What is the evolutionary uh, benefit to glowing in the dark? I feel like it would be the it would be bad because you're trying to hide from predators. Well, I'm sure. I mean, let's see if the study answers that. But I'm sure it's for mating, for them Whoa, to see each cool. other. Okay. Yeah, look at that that's under crazy. the light. That is pretty Yeah, I mean, they have such an insane mating ritual already with the dancing. Yep. They do some dancing. So the males are really colorful and the the female bird of paradise is not, right? Mm -hmm. Typically a drab brown. And then the males have these, just like a peacock, these elaborate feather displays and courtship rituals and things like that. Right, right. Yeah, because I mean, you know, the the guys have to dress up and do all that shit. They they go... So, and then, uh, <laughs> and then the the you know they can just take off. The female is all there, just like in her brown shag, sitting on the egg. She's really just kind of tired. And, and 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 yeah, it says it's for it's for uh, enhancing the contrast against their dark plumage for mating. Okay, there you go. I mean, dude. By the way, it is incredible that you know what's the rarest color found in nature is it blue very good blue yeah i mean look at this that's amazing this is incredible this is like a fluorescent green the beak the head is then black and it's dark gatorade yellow green yes yeah. yellow yeah. green <laughs> let's really do is. let's do a oh, quick real, game yeah Neon. real quick best gatorade flavor it was just that's funny i was gonna yesterday. go very similar to this uh whatever the light blue is yeah icy blue you is agree that with called? that kyle i agree icy blue Whatever the light blue one is. Light blue. Okay. I see blue. Hard disagree. Uh, the wow. blues and the reds leave this disgusting aftertaste stickiness in your mouth that you cannot get rid of. What do you brush your with? teeth? Yellow, dude. You must The original be yellow. Um, original yellow. You too? No, red. Ew, dude. Red is even worse than blue as far uh, as the Isn't red the OG? I think yellow. I think I always think of Gatorade as the original green yellow piss. Yeah, green yellow piss. It's, it's very light. It's, it doesn't sticky in your Purple's mouth. Purple's very popular. I think I could try purple. Think, it's like I, a light blue. I only go light blue. I've never had it. I will try it next yeah. time. Ice cooler. All right. While we're on the topic, I was going to do a very similar thing. Let's just say this quickly because I've been, I'll, I'll, I'll set Sorry. this up. I want you to tell me your favorite bird based on looks because I've had one for hmm. my entire life and I'm thinking of making a switch. Okay. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I mean, I'll go first. Obviously, I don't have as much outside time as you guys do, but I come from Illinois and uh there is a dude literally I just love when I see a male blue jay. Great. Oh yeah, I mean so very beautiful. aggressive and big. Yeah, yes. they're not small. Yeah, no, they're they have, their bird. heads are a they're beautiful. interesting shape. Absolutely I love beautiful bird. Look at that. I mean stunning bird. Very beautiful. Stunning. Mm-hmm. Um I'm going to go with it. I mean I have to. I just have to go with the shoebill. Yeah, great. Awesome animal too. I can't not. I know it's pretty like that's like a basic bitch move. No, I don't think so. I don't think very most people interesting would say looking that. bird though. Yeah, like I mean, not typical face at all. The machine I, gun noise they make. Stork is my close second. I've mm. I've said because they bring babies. <laughs> yes, <laughs> my yes. whole life that the lilac breasted roller is my favorite bird. Can we see one of those, Kyle? Let me get a look. Yeah, Let me I get a look. Lilac breasted. Roller. It's a beautiful. Oh bird. my right. god! Look at this tie dye. It doesn't look real, right? No, that looks that's AI. clearly bioluminescent. <laughs> it, it's crazy, but I think, wow! Look at it with its wings open like that too. So my, it's so funny. My my oldest son is just a little clone of me. So instead of reading storybooks and stuff, now Big that he's head, five, small legs. Yeah, he's got thin legs and his giant head. <laughs> I um, love you. Just he uh, he wants to read field guides, oh, which is exactly nice. what I did at his age, and I haven't pushed that on him or anything. But he wants to thumb through field guides. So been and he he loves birds and I, I as we all know I'm not like a huge bird guy yeah 
Do you relentlessly make fun of him? No, it's <laughs> I, the opposite. calls him a bird nerd. <laughs> bird nerd. The opposite. I encourage it. But um, we've been thumbing through his bird guides, and uh, there's a couple that are just like, Google the Carmine Bee Eater quickly. I've seen them in person, but once we started looking at his books again, I was like, maybe this is better. So you're Look even at that bird. So this is yes. like a crazy pink red dude with a turquoise head. And just like the vibrance of those take, colors. Take a look at it in flight. It looks like a butterfly. It's stunning. It really is. It's Where'd you see this incredible looking bird? Uh, in Zimbabwe. Um, okay. I've seen them because they nest on the on the banks of the Zambezi like you're seeing in that one like group sh uh, shot. Yeah. But, mm. you know, I haven't thought about it in 10 or 15 years. And then we're thumbing through these field guides and this and a few others. And I was just like, might be time for a new bird. Yeah. yeah. Favorite bird. So. Uh, all right, but I mean, would we know this bird or impossible? No, that, I'm, I'm, I'm saying that oh, I, you haven't selected I haven't it selected. Yet. It's okay. going to be a big moment and everybody's going to know about it. But for, <laughs> right, for, yeah. for right now, I'm, I'm shopping for a new favorite. Bird. I know I've, yeah. I've already mentioned dropping things in the comments, but for real, if you don't drop anything else, tell Forrest what bird he should switch to.